Hello guys, how are you today? Again, I'm back with another wonderful tutorial about ZAMP and this tutorial is about how to run ZAMP in your network and how to run a web service in your network that means in your local network you want to run a website for example and uh, other engineer in your local network LAN uh, can use from that website okay in this scenario I run a XAMPP server in my server this is the IP I connect I press the enter the password okay is wrong okay I connect to my server this is my XAMPP server this is my Apache port 18 port 443 okay and it is wrong here I want to run my website you see please look at this part carefully this is my C driver in XAMPP and HDOX it's empty okay I back in my my computer go to drive D and here I write a folder for example zoom okay I copy it and at this one I write my PHP code here this is just a simple example to understanding the part My PHP code is here okay I close it I back to C driver XAMPP folder Apache conf extra again the key is here I want to run for example this site I create from my local system okay I go here Again, I'm back to my D driver, rename it. Here, and the driver is this one. Yes, D. document root is here again the document root directory I enter is here I press ctrl s and this line option indexes follow symbling and uh, allow override all and record I'll grant it is for accessing in your LAN network that means you have to write this code completely in your HTTPD VH house okay I press ctrl s and stop my Apache started again what is wrong and 
first of all I run it in my local in my server that I press local host enter echo this code is run it's correct about your network that means if I close my remote connection and going to my system my client system there is another rule you have to do this rule in your firewall okay I close this one close this one in my control panel this is this settings is in web server firewall advanced setting inbound rules you have to do this one in your server new inbound rule port number next tcp a specific port number port 80 is for http next allowable connection next and domain private and public this is for accessing you know from your public domain and private and the, this there is some description about this over here you can study next write a name for example server description this is yeah and finish after you click on finish because I add this port before I creating this movie I write on the cancel close my firewall setting and I go to my open zero you see the server is run in my LAN network thank you very much for watching this video again I wanna tell you another more explain about ZAM config this is my server I run port 80 in my ZAMP server in another directory the directory I create a folder inside my HTTP host I do these changes restart and my server is run thank you very much if you like please subscribe me your subscribe is really important for me it encourage me to creating more videos i hope see you soon